October 24th, 9.29 p.m. You know, the more that woman talks, the stupider and or the more incompetent she sounds. You know, somebody ought to ask this dingling this question. This would be this would be one I'd love to hear her answer. She keeps talking about damn grocery prices are high because of price gouging. Well, why wasn't there any price gouging under the D Donald Trump presidency days? Hmm. They only started thinking about gouging, gouging Americans for prices when JB was sworn in, huh? How about that shit? This woman don't need the nuclear codes. She is a threat to democracy. She's an, she would be an embarrassment for the United States as president. I mean, can you just hear her on the stage with other world leaders talking? She'd sound like a blithering idiot. We'd be the laughing stock of the world. And lo and behold, if we ever got into a war and we had this idiot as commander-in-chief, what would happen? Yeah, we're fixing to be unburdened, all right. Come November the damn 5th, we'll be unburdened with her ass as a candidate. She is the laughing stock. There's no doubt about it. The Democratic Party as a whole should just be embarrassed to high heaven. This is what they come up with to run for president? Oh, and she was anointed. Hell, if you're going to anoint somebody, goddamn anoint somebody that's got some damn brain power and can talk and put two sentences together that are understandable. And can answer questions. It's not asking a whole lot, is it? Lordy, lordy. Yeah, vote Trump. Trump knows what to do. He's done it before. Oh, yeah. You ever notice this? They ask her. Remember what uh, Anderson Cooper asked her? Oh, yeah, you called Trump's wall stupid about 50 times. Do you th still think it's stupid? What does she do? She laughs. She laughs. Wonder if Lake and Riley's parents were watching that. What do you, how do you think they felt? What a shame. So this border, open border to her is just a, it's just a laugh. It's a gas for her, huh?